Oh, and then no. I will tap my forest <laughs> oh, and activate no. Wirewood Lodge to untap my Nomade Shepherd. <laughs> Everything I did was for nothing! <laughs> <laughs> well, no, it prevents all of you from dying. I get to kill uh, one of you. <laughs> this is incredible! Welcome everyone to the Kurohitsuki stream. We are, we're, we're live and we're ready to start playing some Commander. Uh, so what we do, we're just going to go around the pod circle here. We're gonna start with Dana and then just kind of go around, uh, just say like who we are in the Magic the Gathering community, where people can find us, a brief rundown of your deck, basically like the real zero conversation. Just tell us what the deck is about. You know, if there's any specific combos we should be uh, aware of, you know, that's, that's when you'll tell us. Um, and then the most important question, tell us something about yourself that is not in any way, shape or form magic related so that we can learn a little bit more about the people behind the cards. So we will start with you, Dana. I'm Dana Fisher. I've been playing magic for close to 10 years. So since I was three years old and <laughs> um, I play a lot of elves, I like a lot of green things. Um, and so I'm playing Azuri elves, which puts a bunch of elves on the battlefield, pumps them up, attacks, <laughs> And there's some infinite mana combos of with um, untapping and tapping mana dorks to infinitely pump with Azuri. All right, so super strong is what I'm hearing, but Azuri. Yes. All right, that sounds good. Uh, and then something non-magic related about yourself. Um, I am currently in uh, my school play Beauty and the Beast at nice. and. Uh, our show night is tomorrow and Thursday and Friday and Saturday. Ooh. Okay. Well, that's awesome. I hope that you have a My wonderful last time. Thing before show. What's up? This is basically the last thing I get to do before school and the show. Okay. All right. Well, then we'll make sure it's uh, we'll make sure it's some good games then. Uh, okay. And then over to Benji. Hello, I'm Benji the Brewer. You can find me on Twitch and Twitter and TikTok at Benji the Brewer. I do EDH deck building on Twitch. I get a guest, we spin a couple of wheels, figure out what we're brewing, and then we have an hour to brew it. It is uh, a chaotic and fun time. So if you like that kind of stuff, I'm on every Wednesday at 7 p.m. and every Sunday at 5 p.m. Eastern. I'm just realizing now that's a bit of a tongue twister. It's fine. Um, I am playing Quatly. Uh, this is my naya deck for my 32 deck 32 yeah 32 deck challenge um i'm not a naya player i'm not a naya brewer i said well this is a dinosaur deck but i my commander's not a dinosaur cool i like it it's actually kind of fun uh there's nothing infinite in here but it does go hard pretty quickly uh at least in the couple of games that i played it so i'm looking forward to seeing what that how this plays out this evening um Regarding something non-magic related, uh, well, I will stick with the theater theme. And uh, when I was in, what was it, sophomore year, I was in a play called Bingo, uh, which is a really weird one, like two act play, but it really feels like a one act play. And I played a character who was trying to sell the main character death insurance. So they get paid every month until they die, and then they owe it back. <laughs> Incredible. They get paid every month until they die, and then they... Okay, all right, all right. Yeah. Uh, so that that's my fact. <laughs> okay, well, that's really cool. Uh, yeah, we'll have to ask about uh, more... I, I wonder if everyone has done something theater-wise. <laughs> uh, let's head over to the Nertori and see. Hey, uh, my name's Tori. I can be found all over the internet as that nerd Tori. Largely, I do TTRPG streams. This is my first time doing a magic stream, uh, but I've been playing magic for since just before the pandemic. So not that long, but I do. I'm happy to be here. Uh, I'm playing Galta and Maverin, uh, otherwise known as Vampire Riding a Dinosaur. Uh, it's a silly, silly card, but it does big things. I make tokens, and then I make the tokens bigger, and then I swing at people with them. Uh, I think there is technically one infinite combo in the deck, but I, it's only ever happened once. So don't be scared of it. Uh, and let's see, a fun fact about me that isn't to do with magic. Uh, I'll also go with a theater thing. Um, I am a Foley artist, uh, as my, like... Oh. 
side gig, and I do live Foley for a radio theater. And I'm currently working on an Alice in Wonderland production that will go up in a couple of weeks. Awesome! Okay, well, that is... Okay, that's sick. Being a live Foley, that is, like... We learned about that in my drama class. It's very fun. I found I was good at it accidentally. I auditioned for a community theater uh, company a couple... Well, a lot of years ago now, 2018. And uh, didn't get a speaking role, but they were like, do you want to try Foley? And I was like, yeah, I'll give it a try. And I had a weird natural talent for it. And it's so much fun. You get to take all kinds of, like, household items and bang them together and make fun noises. That's sick. All right. Well, uh, and then uh, on to myself. Welcome, everyone, to the Kurotsuki stream. We are... Uh, I'm, I'm playing uh, Kimena, Tyrant of Arazka. Uh, I got the new, the, the awesome secret lair art of them, um, but yeah, we're I, it's 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 merfolk, it's it's the best merfolk can be, um, which you know is is only saying so much. But listen, we're out here, we're having the our little battle for Ixalan. We're gonna pretend that the the elves are invading Ixalan um, through the Omen paths. So there we go. That that's the lore I'm going with. Uh, this sounds this sounds great. We're gonna we're gonna see who's gonna win the, the kindred off here. Um, I think... I don't even have any infants in a sec. I think it's just a heavy value. Um, and well, I guess in terms of like a non-magic related, but also still in theater theme, it, when I was in high school, I was the vice president and then for a little time, the president of the lighting club, or like the, the lighting crew. Um, so like for all the theater productions and everything, I did the lighting. Um, and it was super cool. I loved being up in the balcony and ha <clears throat> having all that secret access. Felt super sweet. And then, like, later, after, like, uh, losing my previous job, to get this job that I'm at right now, which is at an AV company, uh, it was one of, uh, the people I worked with in the lighting crew, uh, that's, like, working at that company as well. So I'm just like, hey, I mean... You know my resume, so <laughs> you know, let's let's hey, see if I can get employed. Then boom, here I am. So, all right, we all have a little bit of theater background, one way or another. Mm -hmm. I love it. All right, well, let's see if we can put on a wonderful performance today. Uh, we're going to roll two d sixes to see who is going to go first. Super fancy. All right, shall mm -hmm. I get started? I suppose. All right. Well, I'll draw a card. Fine, gnarly. That's um, everyone else who goes first, correct. And... Mulliganing this. I will put down this game trail untapped. I'll show this forest. Uh, and then I'll tap that game trail to play a turn one soul ring. Whoa! Don't uh, <laughs> worry about it. That is I... a card this deck does not have. <laughs> oh, and does not need. And does not need. Right? <laughs> oh yeah, it's elves. Um, but that's it for me. I have no follow-up. I'll pass. Okay. Excellent. No, that's my Ixalan. Mm -hmm. Ixalan. Is it whose turn now? Mine? Yes. The, uh, yes. Wonderful. All right. I will remember to draw a card. I will uh, play a forest, and I will pass because I'm playing honest magic. Good <laughs> honest magic. That's what we like to hear. Um, I'm going to play this... That's actually an awful idea, right? Uh, no, how bad could it be? Awful, actually. Whatever, I'm going to play this uh, Mirrored Landscape tapped and pass. Also, of course, playing Fair Magic. Fair and Balanced. I'll pass. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play a Forest and cast an Essence Warden. Ooh. Well, I guess go ahead and go. Untap, draw. Uh, I'll play an unclaimed territory naming dinosaur. Are you sure you don't want to name elves? <laughs> I am. I'm. I. You I'm almost convinced me. She's asking no. a good question. She's asking a good question. You know. I. It's. It is a good question. I'm gonna stick with the dinos. Just you know, for for funsies. <laughs> Um, and I'm gonna control of the land can't tap it for mana. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and cast this curious altasaur. It's a two five dino with vigilance and reach. And whenever a dino I control deals combat damage to a player, I'll draw a card. I will also um, gain a life from that. Yeah, you will, and I'll pass. 
Excellent. Untap, upkeep, draw. Alright, we will play a planes and then realize we didn't keep a good opening hand and pass. <laughs> um, I will play an island and I will also pass. Hey, we're in the same boat. <laughs> we're in the same boat. I will play a forest and also pass. All right. Uh, Curious all the sorts that has vigilance and reach. Yeah, it's fine. Oh my gosh, and the two five. I'll play this forest. Uh, it will be ob obnoxious and continue to ramp with this I'm rampant fresh. growth. I don't know yeah, where the term ramp came from. This. Yeah, right. Da, 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 da. <laughs> For the longest time, I thought it was because you were going up a ramp of like increasing mana. <laughs> I love that. I love I don't that. Know where, where the word came from. I also couldn't remember what stacks meant for the longest time because I kept wanting it to mean stacking things on top <laughs> of each other. Right, yeah. It's uh, You look at the stack and you just play a bunch of spells. That's mm -hmm. the stacks. Yeah. 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 Um, so I'm going to shuffle because I put down a planes. I'm going to go ahead and also cast. Oh, I shouldn't shuffle because I'm doing this commander thing. When Hwatley enters the battlefield, search your library for a basic land card, reveal it, and put it into your hand. Uh, when uh, Hwatley enters the battlefield, I will gain a life. Yes, you will. I'll get right, a gnarly, force it's like, wow, that, and then I'll resume the shuffling. However, uh, for the life gain shenanigans, I will swing a 2-5 at Dana. I will not block and go back down to 40. Awesome. As soon as I'm done shuffling, I will draw a card off of that. And, That's uh, life totals. Yeah. Uh, that'll be it for me. I'll pass. Excellent. All right. Let's draw a card. Okay, we're getting somewhere now. Uh, we are going to play another forest. And we are going to tap, uh, tap everything to cultivate. Um, so I'm going to grab two basic lands, and they're both going to be planes. Uh, let me, let me just look at the top bit. Not gonna lie, some people explain Maybe stacks means here. that still default to tax cards. Oh, there's one. That's, I mean, that's what it means. Oh, and there's two, hell yeah! Right? And then I am, I'm not going to do anything else, I'm going to pass, because I will only have one land, and it will be tapped. Doki. I, on the other hand, with my great and brilliant plays, will play this forest and pass the turn. Oh gonna, boy! I'm just gonna crack it for crack the mirrored landscape for two islands now. I'm going to play a wirewood lodge, which hats for a colorless, and I can spend a green to untap an elf. And I will cast Elvish Arch Druid, gaining me a life. And it gives my elves plus one plus one. Essence Warden is an elf. And I will. My name is good to see you, my friend. Hope you're doing well. Alrighty. Let's untap. Oh, we're having a Drop good night turn. so far. Just started this wonderful game with some wonderful people, and I'm looking forward to it being uh, a what? pretty chill night. Wow. I should have grabbed. It's fine. And I have an I'll all play foil uh, land base from uh, Ixalan. Like, how how could I feel bad? What do I want to do? What do I want to do? By I'll tap these two for a wayward eyes. sword tooth. Uh, it is currently not. I, I do not have the blessing of the city. Uh, which is fine. You know, I'll Imagine. cry about it later. Um, You're at nine. I'm, I'm very close. In fact, this allows me to play another land. Uh, oh. So now I the city... I get a life from that. Yeah. Now the city will bless me. Um, you did that just to flex? <sighs> look, I, I don't <laughs> often get to say hashtag blessed, but here we are. <laughs> uh, I'll play a bop. I saw the dinosaur. Bop. It, I will also get a life from that. Birds are dinosaurs. <laughs> yeah, that's Dang it, true. You're right. Oh no, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I'll also play this intrepid paleontologist. I will get I'll, another life. I don't like how much board state is going on over there. 
I'm sure it will not last long. It's fine. Um, I will... <laughs> Dana, you can't keep gaining life. I'm going to swing at you again. I will take two, go down to 42. <laughs> and I will draw a card. Um, I'm that... sure by this. <laughs> I will pass. Excellent. I'm tippity-tap. Oops. Keep draw. Wonderful. All right. We are going to play a planes. We are going to tap three. I'm a mess. To play Jahira, friend of the forest. Uh, tokens I control are mana dorks uh, for green. And do the two, three. And I will pass. I love that card. Me too. I will pass. High strange. Okay. Ooh, Jahira, the friend of the forest. And she's also an elf, so... She is. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Stealing cards from Dana's egg is messed up. <laughs> she's just hanging out with the dinosaurs. Yeah, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> she's a traitor. This, this deck is <laughs> Selesnya good stuff at the end oh, of the day. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I also gain a life from that. To be so lucky um i'm going to not take that damage for that i'm going to play forerunner of the heralds um merfolk uh etb i'm going to look for a merfolk and put it to the top of my deck and also whenever a merfolk comes into play she will get a plus plus encounter i will gain a life you shall. I'm going to get a hackball surge of the soul, and then I will pass the turn. I will play Nykthos, Shrine to Nick. Nice. Um. I need to get one of those. Been on my to buy list for a very long time. Oh, absolutely. And they're constantly expensive. I don't think they've ever yeah. been reprinted? Question mark? Uh, no, I think it's only been printed once. Yeah, just the Theros. But it needs to be in the Chandra deck. Yeah. The Oops All Chandras. Oh, absolutely. Because <laughs> that's my deck that John played. Uh, I will play a Canopy te te Tactician, um, which buffs all my other elves, and I'll make three green. Uh, and and I can tap it to make three green. I'll gain a life nice. off of my essence warden. Um, and then I will tap Elvishard Strid for three, and cast Steel Leaf Champion, which gains me another life. And that is a five four that can't be blocked uh, by creatures with power two or less. Um, and. That will be all. Okay. It's the. Uh, it's the, the. I know I'm playing a lot of ramp. This one with the vampire. That's getting scary up there. Um, <laughs> you also have a big board. I I'm not com I I mean I am complaining a little bit, but you know, it is what it is. And your creatures are generally pretty big, so you know. At least I can block. Well, even th this can't block. That's hilarious. My my chunky dinosaur cannot block your guy. Um, all right. So let's see what I want to do. I think I'll play this Kessig Wolf run. And then one, two, one, two, three. I will transform Plotly. Um... Watley becomes a saga. Chapter one says create two, three, three green dinosaur tokens. I will gain two life upon those entering. And then, oops, let's put that there. And then fill these out. I don't do art on my tokens. It's fine. That's so valid. I usually draw stick figures. I'm just bad at drawing, but I like doing it anyway. I would feel, feel like, very valid. 
if I because I will forget to do it if it's not my turn, so I have to do it when I when I make them, mm -hmm. and then I'm like, oh no, I'm holding up the game. I can't spend time on this dumb art. <laughs> okay, fine, we'll pass. No, um, I, I'm not passing now though. I'm gonna <laughs> see about maybe. Do I want to do anything else? Um, I think what we'll do is we will send, I think it's that thing. Gonna move to combat. I will send this 2-5 out over to Kuro. No, they can sign out. Uh, I'm taking how much damage? How could you do this to me? Two. Two? I suppose I'll take two. All right. I uh, I will draw a card off of that. Oh, okay. Simply wanted to draw a card off of me. I see how it is. I it was a, it was a gamble. Like you could have blocked with your forerunners, and I would have been I, fine with that too. I could have um, blocked with a three two. That's right. I will play this forest as my second land for turn, and then I'm gonna. Do I want to pass? I have two. I only have those. Yeah, I'll pass. Alrighty. Untippity tap. Upkeep. Draw. Man, I, I'm drowning in lands. Uh, let's see. We'll play another forest. And Can then... The obsession with Nyssa? Uh, no. <laughs> Not unhealthy at all in the slightest. What do you mean? Let's see. Let's see. Is that Seal Champion? And what's the card all the way to the right? Is that Seal Leaf Champion? Uh, yeah. Okay, perfect. I recognize it just on the mana value alone. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty good mm -hmm. with cards of cards, too. Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, you definitely have to be. I mean, I've played in different countries. I yeah, yeah. started when I couldn't read the cards. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> See, reading the card explains the card, or deciphering the pictures explains the card. Exactly. <laughs> All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tap five, one, two, three, four, five, to play Rabble Rousing. Love it has hide away five, so I exile top five cards in my library or Look at the top five cards in my library and exile one face down. I can count to five. One, two, three, four, five. And let's see, let's see. Come on, Zoomy. Mm. Come on. Come on. Okay. I'm Come gonna on. exile this one face down. Thank you so much. Over Come here. On. Put the rest on the bottom Stop of my library point. in a random order. All right. Judge, and how then... Did you prove that was random? <laughs> and then I am going to... Let's see. Pearl, what um creature do you have up? Me? Yeah. A 3-2 that I'm not blocking with? Unless. Unless. Um... I'm gonna. I'm going to take that risk, and I'm going to swing at you for two. <laughs> oh, wow. yeah. oh, you want to? You want a goober? Fine, I'll take two. Cool. I want. I want a little green white citizen. I'm gonna make you all regret swinging at me one of these days. <laughs> uh, no, and I easily could have. While I while I look <laughs> no, through no, no, my no. <laughs> while I look through my box of alphabetized tokens to find my citizen, I will uh, pass the turn. Okay. And when that citizen draw. enters the battlefield, I will gain a life. Here it is. I pride myself on uselessly collecting tokens and then alphabetizing them. Oh, we have oh, so many tokens, which are also alphabetized and sorted into color. Ooh, very nice. I haven't had to sort them into color yet. They all fit in here, but... Oh, well, we have way more tokens than that, so we just <laughs> pull out the cards that we need for each of our different decks and put the tokens in there. That is so understandable. I'm going to play Hackball of the Surging Soul. That's going to be a plus one plus encounter on my and four over the hills. Hills. Hmm? I'll, I'll gain a life from that. True. So true. 
Um, I will then go the combat at the beginning of combat on my turn. Each merfolk uh, creature I control explores. So I'll do right to left. So, um, deep root waters. I'll keep that to the top for both of these. So that is a plus one plus one counter on both. Um, and I will then go the combat. Or no, I'm in combat. Um, let's swing five. Who wronged me the most recently? Three, four, five, five, four. How big is that wayward sword tooth? Oh, look, those are three through dinos. That's, that's so strange. Um, that's so the rude. The sword uh, tooth is a five, five. Yeah, of course it is. You know what? The merfolk are peaceful. We know, we have no need to swing. Is what I tell myself. And then I will pass the turn. <laughs> Alright. I will untap and draw. That seems more than putting in the work tonight. Truly! Yeah. Somebody yeah. stop it. <laughs> yeah. I wish I had pulled any been, removal. Would have been so much better on the play, but you know, or going first, but you know, whatever. I'll, I'll activate Nykthos to add uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 mana. Wait, didn't it go first? Was it the first creature out? It was the first creature out, but I didn't go first. I went last. Oh, eh, it was the Soul Ring. He didn't miss anything. <laughs> uh, I'll, so I'll make seven mana. I'll use one of it to cycle Tranquil Thicket. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, and draw. I'll use two of it down to four to cast Twine and Delete. Uh, which will trigger making an elf token, which will trigger essence for life. Oh, it's adorable. All right. Yeah. Well, now we can't block the one one token. Dang it. No. You have one, don't Thank you? Thank you very much, Sir Magic. I appreciate it. It could use it could use some work. Um, uh, and then I do have one. That's right. Yes. Yeah. I'll use one of. So I'll go down to three. Cast a wirewood symbiote. Uh, gain a life. I'll go down to one. Cast a thorn uh, weld archer. Gain a life. Wirewood's uh, thorn weld archer is a two one elf with reach and death touch. Yeah. And wirewood symbiote is a one one. It's not an elf, but it can return an elf to untap a creature only once each turn. I do love it when insects are one of the best elf cards ever made. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> I love this card in Legacy. Yeah, I, I try. I try to keep it uh I'm going to tap being able to click on the spell table page one, is like definitely. Uh, I wish Archdrid. I have one mana floating right now and I'll tap I wish Archdrid for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more, so I'll get an eight floating. Uh, oh dear god. <laughs> Somebody um, stop her. I got nothing. <laughs> I only have one card in hand and I'm gonna cast it, which is a null mage shepherd. Um going down to four mana floating. I'll gain a life. I can tap oh four on that creatures to destroy an artifact or enchantment. <laughs> Only one card in hand is fine. Holy and moly. Not meant to be handed. Um, yeah, that's true. That's and true. And then with the four mana floating, I'm going to bounce the Dwine's Elite with Rywood Symbiote to untap the Arch Druid. Uh, I'll go down uh, to two mana floating, cast uh, Dwine's Elite, gain two more life because I'll make another elf token. Um, oh my god. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It it Wirewood Symbiote, the mo like the earliest, most notable card with the cursed uh sentence, activate this ability only once each turn. Thank God. Yeah, thank <laughs> God. <laughs> Literally go almost that would go infinite. I mean it would go way too easily infinite. It, it would be a banned card if so, because that, mm -hmm. that was just way too easy. Yeah. Uh and then with two mana floating. Trid I will to load. um Tap Elvish Archdrid again yeah, for this. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine more mana. So I'll go to eleven floating. Yeah, it's just nine. I'll go down to oh eight floating. Oh my god! Cast Zuri. Ah uh, yes. Gain alive. Uh, my commander. Um, the I have three non-summoning sick creatures right now. Um, I will activate the Wirewood Lodge. Uh, down to um. Seven floating to untap my Elvish Arch Druid. Then I'll tap my Elvish Arch Druid. Um, and then, um, uh, yeah, for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more mana. So I'll go to 17 floating. 
Mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. I will activate a Zuri three times. Yeah. Of course, honestly. Um, and then I will go to combat. Yeah. This is amazing. Yeah. <laughs> I will send Relief Champion at Benji, Canopy tact Tactician at Tori, and Essence Warden at Kuro. Yeah. All right, how big is that Steel Leaf Champion? It is, uh, let's see. Uh, Three, six, nine, everything is getting plus nine. nine. Um, everything's plus 11, plus 11. Oh! The yeah, can of protection, because I have two extra lords. So Steel sense. Leaf Champion is a 16, 15. And what's uh, the thing coming at me? Uh, you will have, um, nine, uh, 13, 13. All, all of these have trampled. And, uh, Kuro, I'm you gonna will take have it. 12, 12. Uh, 12-12. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna take it. And the Steel Champion can't be blocked by creatures with power to the west. And also has trend. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh-huh. This so, is so cool. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna respond. Hey y'all, I'm grateful to be out here and sponsored by Into the AM, aka the sickest apparel brand you can find online. Into the AM is not just a shop, but it's a team of artists and creators who have one common vision. And that vision is to bring you apparel that not only elevates your comfort, but also your self-expression. I, personally, am a huge sci-fi fan, so Into the AM space and astronautical graphic tees are a no-brainer. There are also tees for a more casual everyday wear, and those deserve a spotlight too, because I'm telling you, they actually do feel really good. If you're looking to upgrade your wardrobe in a way that's affordable, maintains your comfort level, and has you covered in style, then Into the AM has a bundle going on right now that's three graphic tees for only 60 bucks. Click on the link in my description below and use code OneCurl to get an additional 10% off your entire order. Oh. 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 Do I want... Uh... Let's do a Return of the Wild Speaker. Oh. And let's give all my non-human creatures plus three plus three. Mm -hmm. Okay. How about every human on the field? <laughs> I mean, if I would, I might not. My elf would get buffed. Oh wait, <laughs> wait, 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 wait! I take it no, back. No, 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 not that, not <laughs> no, that. No, 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 no. <laughs> um. So I will soak up. Let's see. That's uh twelve. <laughs> And then yeah. I will soak up an additional. That's eight. This is a sixteen fifteen right now. Yeah, I'll put twenty. Uh, twenty right. power, twenty toughness in front of it. I'll kill the uh, wayward saber tooth and one of the dinos. Sure. And this will die. Dino remains. Tori, any blocks? No, I already took the 12 or 13. Just okay. tears. <laughs> I'll be uh, fine. I'll be fine. What's the worst that could that happen? That is my turn. I will be done. All right. Time for the dino board wipe. Right, Benji? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this last turn of the game. I really like board wipes because they're all trying to go big and go wide. I will draw for turn. This will go to chapter two, and it says all of my creatures. Well, this has creatures I control tap for red, green, or white. Um, There's a dino board. Called, yeah, Star of Extinction. <laughs> what was that? Uh, what's the third chapter on the on um, plot thing? You can mouse over Benji's commander. It shows you the the backside. Oh right, right, right. yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. It's like a little card. It's like you know, it's like whatever. I'll put in this secluded courtyard, naming dinos. Not elves. Again, I want to check. You're not naming elves. <laughs> that is correct. Nor am I naming brushwags. <laughs> <laughs> Dana, I think that means we need it. Like we, Benji needs to write it down, right? Like write it down on a sticky note and put it on the card. That's like the official that is the competitive tournament. way to do that it. That is tournament. Well, it's not technically tournament rules, but it's tournament customs. Okay. I usually well. don't have to do that on my cabin souls because everyone knows <laughs> naming elves. What? Well, hey, listen. You could be. <laughs> it could. Except for Thanos. Oh, 
standard now uh, Golgari midrange is playing it, and there's a couple of different creature types that I could That's name. Fair. So I'll probably just like make a label maker with all the possible creature types that I can name. Fair enough. All right, Benji, what do you got? Much. I think we oh. do die to this board on Dana's next turn. Mm -hmm. Probably. Uh, so. I'll swing, I'll move to combat, and I'm going to swing both of these at you. Um, okay, how big are they? Uh, currently a 2-5 and a 0-1. <laughs> Get that bird in there. Get the damage in there. I will... Um, I will block the 2-5 with two three threes. Okay. Uh, that's all your blocks? Yeah. Great. Uh, in response to attacks, or in response to blocks being declared? Uh, I'm gonna pump the birds by two, four, six, eight. Okay. So you'll take okay. eight. I'll go down to 50. Look, that's all I got. <laughs> Dang, it's something. It's something. <laughs> we got it to 50, everyone. <laughs> Dinosaur will die. It's being blocked by two three threes. Oh yeah, that's fine. That's it. I'll pass. Oh boy, let's Dana's. see what I can do over here with this. All right, time for Wrath of God. I wish. Oh god, <laughs> if I had a few more turns, man. Uh, let's see. We'll play <laughs> planes. We you will play a CEDH up in here. Uh, seriously. <laughs> No, we don't need this that. Typical I really felt this deck. I updated it, but it was my first custom Bell Commander deck that someone gave to me. So. Nice. Nice. Turns out the elves do be elven. That's why I love them. Mm -hmm. Did I just play a land? I think, I think, I think so. so. Did I? Okay. Yeah. Five, six, seven. Yeah. Sure. I thought I had one more. Your token taps for Amanda. Yeah, one? but I thought I, I thought I had. I thought I would have eight. I mean, if you don't think you play the like, if you don't think you play the land, like, there you go. Whatever. What did, did anyone else not miss a land drop? I've missed many land drops. I. I think I didn't miss a land drop. No, I did not miss a land drop. But I know you have I one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, oh no, I... landscapes though. So, hmm. no, I, who knows? So it would be eight. Oh. oh. Okay. I think it still would be eight because you have to. And I had a cultivate. Okay. So yeah. yeah I can't tell because I knew, I've that, I, knew I had counted correctly. Okay. <laughs> Turns so... out in green, that like a green versus green versus green versus green. There's <laughs> no way to backtrack how All many right. lands we're supposed to have. Let's do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, half, Dalton Maverick. <laughs> we, woo! Let's They're go. here. They're here. And Let's then go. what we're going to do uh, is. Let's see what we're going to do. We are going to tap, tap, uh, to. Did I drop a card somewhere? I must have. This card's just up your sleeve. It, it, clearly. Did I drop something? Oops, I dropped this uh, Supreme Verdict. How'd that get there? Anyway, let me cast that. In your deck that's not able to play blue? Yeah, I wonder. <laughs> yeah. Oops, I'm so oh, oh no. Oh, I put it over here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and it was floating over here. Okay, I'm tapping the citizen in this. To uh, play Galta Primal Hunger. Woo! Uh, I would I two life from both those creatures. Yes, you do. <laughs> yes, you do. It's all part of the plan, clearly. Uh, and then I'm going to try, I guess. And I don't know. I will swing Jahira at Kuro. Yeah. Uh. Yep. For two. Uh, you know what? Just for you, friend, I'll take two. Oh, I'll, I'll, uh, because I'm attacking, I'll make a 2-2 a dinosaur 
because Jahira, and then I'll make another citizen. And I will gain two life from those. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Can't let uh, get away with this. <laughs> I don't fine. think we've got an option. <laughs> oh, I see. I'm not even gonna draw a dino. I'm just gonna make a two-two dino. Uh, all right, and then I'm gonna pass and prepare to die. I'm gonna sacrifice this waterlog to Grove to draw a card. I'm sure we're gonna get there. I can think of maybe one Merfolk that will get us out of this. Ooh. Was that the merfolk? Mm, no. However, it might be. Oh. Okay, let me think. Um, I could do. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm not. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right, um, I'm going to go the combat. Hackball is going to explore, go left, right, top deck, land, goes to hand, and rally the Galadrin. Create a token that's a copy of target creature I control with Conspire. I will put that in the graveyard because I don't think I'm ever gonna want that right now. Uh, so that's a Hackball with a counter. And... I will um not swing and then I will um I will play uh, yeah, I, can, I can I can play I could play that. Yeah, that's totally fine. Totally Ooh, fine. Lord of Atlantis. Yeah. Look at that white yeah, border. Dude. Yeah, the yeah. OG Melissa Benson art. Oh, that, I hate the white border. It's so ugly. Me too. But it's, <laughs> I, I listen, I, I am in no way, shape, or form a fan of old border. But uh, it's like an older version of it, so I'm happy about it. I will pass the turn, and I get a plus plus. That okay. didn't solve our problems. No, 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 no. But it's probably something instant speed. Yeah, 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 yeah. I will draw. Um. Okay. I know you have something, but like. I'm absolutely one hundred and twelve percent. I have something. I'm. I'm not even gonna. Mixed I just words. don't know I what it. it is. Mm hmm. Uh, I think I just have to go for Save it. Say curl. You got it. I'm on it. Okay. How you said you're, are, are you Can going to combat? Um. Yes, I'm going to combat. Okay, so in response, you go into combat. I'm going to Port of Calling. Yes. Uh, put the three green and so four blue. So I'm gonna get a four drop from the deck. To okay. The, uh, yes. Okay. Okay. Here's your card. Yes. For me, I'm like, wait, this is the green sun. Can I only get a green card? <laughs> no. It's gonna feel very silly, but no, it's all good. We're fine. Oh, I guess I could have done that, but this is no, I couldn't have done. That. Um, we're going to get a Tempest Caller. When Tempest Caller enters the battlefield, tap all creatures, target player, control, target the opponent. No! Controls. <laughs> we I... get one more turn. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I respond. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. No. <laughs> Look at possibly okay. respond in mono green. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like the counting. The counting's no, unnecessary. No, me neither. <laughs> the counting's so unnecessary. <laughs> Come on. 
come on. What's the worst that could happen? Just let me, just let me. Just let me a strip for uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mana. Sure, yeah. Um, and then I will use two of that to activate Nykthos. Mm -hmm. uh, so going down to seven, but up to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, um, so up to seventeen. Mm -hmm. At instant speed. Um, going to seventeen mana. Uh -huh. I will let that resolve. Okay. Or actually, sorry. I'll go up to. I'll tap this for three more, going up to twenty mana. Sure. Oh god, oh god! <laughs> What's and the then, worst oh, thing? I'm gonna top, um, four with the Null Mage Shepherd to destroy, uh, Watley. Oh, Dude. yeah! She's an enchantment! No! Oh my god. And then the rest of my guys will tap. Um, still before attacks are cleared, I've got 20 mana floating. You do. Uh, okay, I'll activate a Zuri four times. Oh, what? Um, and then I will <laughs> activate Wirewood Symbiote to bounce the Dwine and Zelite and untap the Thornwood Archer. Oh, and no. And then I will tap my forest <laughs> and activate oh, no. Wirewood Lodge to untap my Nolmate <laughs> Shepherd. <laughs> Everything I did was for nothing! <laughs> <laughs> well, no, it prevents all of you from dying. I get to kill uh, one of two people. <laughs> This is incredible! <laughs> um, okay, and then I'm going to declare attackers. Um, <laughs> what a line! David's brain is so big. <laughs> it, this is incredible. Um, I will send uh, the Nomad Shepherd at Kuro. And Thornwald Archer at Benji, both of which um, get plus are 16 power. Thornwald Archer is a 16-15. Nolmaid Shepherd is a 16-18. Oh my gosh! I declare this no block. Amazing. Uh, I will not block. Okay. So each will take 16. Yeah. Uh, post combat, I'll play a land for the turn. Tap two and cast Dwine and Zolite. Um, getting me an elf token and I'll gain uh, two life. Oh god. Going up to 56. And <laughs> I will pass. Alright. Tor, you're gonna be looted our only hope. Swing with oh, them, Galtus! Swing with them! <laughs> we got- we got stress over here. Oh boy. <laughs> Benji, I think- is that all, Dana? Yeah, is that- is that all? <laughs> Thanks, Daddy! <laughs> Dana, or, uh, Benji, I think- I think you know what must be done. I have nothing to do. Exactly. So do nothing. No! If you have nothing to do, you can charge Tori's turn with that Kessig Wolf run. I mean, I can, I can also get through with my bird and deal a bunch of damage, too. I do have a right, but that sounds that way less impactful. <laughs> yeah, but that sounds way less impactful than a trampling Galta getting even bigger. Galta and Maverin. Uh, and, sorry, excuse me. And normal Galta. Well, yeah. Oh, that's Where X true. Is the greatest power among creatures that are already attacking? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, commander damage is a valid thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, I'll hang, I'll hang back, and I'll pass. Boy, oh boy! <laughs> All right, Sorry, our I'm, only hope. <laughs> I'm freaking terrified. Um, <laughs> so untap, upkeep, draw. Save Ixalan. Save the world. <laughs> I'm. So, do you have any blockers up, Dana? Just so I know. I have Dwine and Zelite and an Elf token, and I can untap anything at instant speed with my Wirewood Symbiote. 
Cool. Okay. Good, 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 good. But only one thing, right? That can only be done once each turn. <laughs> Thank oh, <nice>. God. <laughs> uh, okay. Here's well, what we're gonna do. It, it can be used to untap the mana dork, which is gonna get a lot of mana, and I think Azuri can be activated at instant speed, too. Azuri right. can be uh, uh, activated at instant speed. Yeah, yeah, I don't think I can actually get through what I want to get through, but I'm but going to try. Best. Yeah, it's the best you can One, do. Two. For sure. Yeah. All of our hopes and dreams ride on this ma <laughs> ride on the back of this Galton Maverick duo. The uh, all right seven. Uh, Zapandrel. Ooh. Under Dominus. Oh 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 oh. Um. Let me know before you go to combat. Yeah. What does Zapandrel do again? Uh, at the beginning of each combat, double the power and toughness of each creature I control until end of turn. Okay. Um, <laughs> so, let's see, what are we going to do here? Wish I had one more mana. Uh, I will gain a life from that entry. <laughs> yeah, that's... <laughs> yeah. Oh, I wish I had one more mana. Did you gain a life from my Tempest caller entering as well? Oh, no, I don't. I have don't have a land in hand, so I can't. You have you have three tokens that tap. I need five. I've got one, two, three, four. Uh, so I need five. And you, this is something that you need to do before combat. I think so. Okay. Um. Well, okay. Don't let all the top eight pins intimidate you. We believe in you. you I know. am trying not to look at those. Okay, so what I'm going to do <laughs> is I'm going to move to combat. Before you move to combat. Okay, I'm. Before I move to combat. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, tap the Kessig Wolf Run and give your commander mm -hmm. uh, two, four, six, eight. Plus 10 power. So it's a 22, 12, double. Yeah. So it's a 44, 24. <laughs> okay. Yes. Oh, God. A 44, 24. <laughs> I've got a commander, damn it. Uh, and let's see. I will also swing out. With, so we're gonna swing at you with Galton Mavern, obviously. Uh, I'm also gonna swing out with a 24 24 Galta that will, um, that will make a big boy dino token that is also 24 24. I'll gain a life from that. <laughs> Tori, careful. <laughs> <laughs> Careful now. No, I'm scared. I'm scared. Uh, <laughs> We're getting it's, also, <laughs> it's also tapped and attacking, so it's also coming at you. Uh, how big's the commander? Uh. Oh 40, god. Forty-four. Forty. Yeah. 40. It's because it was it was twelve plus ten is twenty-two. Doubled is forty-four. Twenty-four. All right. I'm going to. Bounce my Thornwood Archer to untap. I'm also my making two citizens. Then I'm going to what? Yeah, two citizens. Uh, I, I have citizens. a couple more things to resolve. I'm a uh, oh. two more citizens happen. Gain two more life. And I think that triggers your. You should have ten, right? Yes. One, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. So then I get to play best soul nourisher, which doesn't do anything really for us. But I love that card though. <laughs> she's here and she's doing her thing. Um, I will gain a life from that. Uh, this isn't an instant, so I can't do that. Um. So I think where we stand is that there's a 44-24 commander coming at you and two 24-24 dinosaurs. 
Yes. I'm going to move to blocks. I'm going to triple block your commander with my three creatures. But okay. for four damage. This is the anime moment where Dana's just combining the power of all the elves together. <laughs> I will pop Elvish Archdrid for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, to activate a Zuri once. I'm one short because one I had to bounce short. out. Um, but, and so then this will be, this is five. Um. I fully believe this, that this will this not take her out. This is seven. And this is, uh, three, four, five, six. Uh, so these are both six, so that's 12 plus seven, which is 19. If I had one more mana, I think I survive. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Wait! Did do it? <laughs> yeah. Wait, yeah, 44 it. minus 19. Yeah. yeah. If, I, that... if I had one more elf, then one, I would yeah, have to bounce an extra time, which is an extra nine. Yo! Yeah! <laughs> you had to bounce the elf in order to untap it, right? Yeah, there's no way to exactly. sequence that. Exactly, and, so, and because that's the cost, I can't tap it before Do those oh. blocks... Do those blocks kill Galta and Maverin? Uh, no. No? Oh, okay. Somehow, um, yeah, somehow, somehow, no. Somehow. You guys are in trouble. You're not wrong. Listen, Dana, you're not wrong. It's <laughs> fine. I don't know. It's I don't know how fine. We made. Uh, wait, oh! are, those, are those counters you gave Galta and Maverin permanent? Nope. Oh, thank God. No, no, no. no. <laughs> thank God for all of you. Uh, oh. hey. uh well... That sure is my turn. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Okay. Well, we saved Ixalan from the uh, from the elves, but now unfortunately, the <laughs> there's just some big ass dinosaurs, and they're angry. Yeah, they're so angry. Um. All right. Well, that was cool, you know, and that was neat and pretty awesome. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea what to do about the rest of this. Um, probably not much of anything. Um... Remember when I said if I can have Zopandril and Galta and Maverin you out? You did say that! It is a little nasty! That's right. Yeah, editor, go back to when <laughs> she said this, they said this exact thing. Galta and Maverin, uh, otherwise known as Vampire Riding a Dinosaur. Uh, it's a silly, silly card, but it does big things. I make tokens, and then I make the tokens bigger. And then I swing at people with them. Um, all right. Uh, yeah, I will just do my best. And listen, we, we have like time for another game after, so it is all Gucci. I'm just gonna play. Or no, I'm gonna play. Uh, Deep root waters. So whenever I cast a Merfolk, I get a Merfolk token. <laughs> I'm going to cast Kimena. I will get a Merfolk token first. A Merfolk ETBs. I will get a plus and plus encounter here. Uh, and then another one ETBs. I will get another plus and plus encounter. Um, yeah, flashback. Um, all right. So this is what my you know turn seven five looks like. Um, <laughs> hope you're all very impressed. Um, I will go to combat, and of course, does the patch will trigger on your on other combats too, or is it just yours? It's uh, the end yeah. of each combat. Oh, cool! It's just like that big, dumb, stupid enchantment that I hate. Yep. <laughs> Unnatural growth. I I hate it so much. Ugh. Or uh, <sighs> there's there's red ones that do that too. The double all damage that yes. everybody does. Uh, I'm going to explore from left to right. So let's go. Lightning Greaves. Don't need that, but that's a counter. Uh, Grimoire Thief. Don't need that. That's a counter. Rivendell. Goes in the hand. Kindred Discovery. I mean, at this point. <laughs> uh, Deep Breath Elite. Yavamaya Coast. Alrighty. Alrighty dighty then. Um. I'll swing out everything at Boy. me. Oh, I, uh, one, two, three, four, five, 
5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Everything over there is doubled, but they're also really small. Oh, it's true. <clears throat> um, I have 20, I have 22 total damage right here. That's pretty cool. Right. Um, what to do about it? Don't mind if I do. I'm gonna put a ribbon down in the play, and that'll show you. That'll show you what for. Um, and <sighs> dang, I will swing all of this at uh, uh, Tori. Uh, you know what? <laughs> you know what? I want all my things to live. Oh. I will swing at Benji. There's no difference between who I swing at right now. I am. I am okay. at six life. That is ridiculously rude. <laughs> <laughs> what is your smallest thing? Uh, my smallest thing is this Tempest Collar, which is a 3-4. Three, th three, Never mind, it's technically this 3-3 three, three Lord of Atlantis. Okay, I'll block is the that it? Is that it doubled into 3-3? Three, three? That can't be true. No, it can't. Wait, does Zapandra all? No. Yeah. No, no. Oh, it's uh, just yours. I There's control. No Never mind. Never There's mind. No way. Okay. <laughs> If anything, can't I'm surprised read. it doesn't, like, you know, have other people's creatures, so. Yeah, I can't uh, read. It's fine. I'm tired. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. I'm killing the, the Lord of Atlantis. My Lord of Atlantis, no. Uh, and how much am I taking? Uh, 22 minus 3. 19. Cool, 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 cool. Carl, you're dead on my turn. That's out of super sure. Yeah, how dare you? 112%. How dare you? Uh, I will pass the turn. Talk me into helping take down Dana, and then you swing at me. I we I swung at politics. <laughs> this is not even politics. This is taking down the 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 tyrant. I don't have Galt to stampede tyrant in this deck. Oh well. Yet. Um. Let's see. That seems fun. Uh. Let's do one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, for Gishath? Yeah, Gishath. Gishath. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't understand. Oh my god! Okay, right. I have nothing Not else to do. Anyone who casts a counter spell will feel my fury. <laughs> that's uh, I nasty. have nothing else to do. That's nasty. That that's really rude, Kuro. Uh I'm that's fine. It's done. I'm passing. Okay. <laughs> I have nothing else to do. Untap. Oh, Take us out, Tori. Draw. Let's see what are we gonna do? You got the Zapandril. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Ah, oh, man! I drew a Halo Fountain. It could have been real funny. I could have finally won with Halo Fountain if I just had a few more little guys. Uh, let's yes, see. Yes, the giant army of dinosaurs. How does it win? Well, you know. Let's see. Um, we are going to, uh, first things first, tap five. One, two, three or five to play <laughs> overwhelming stampede um until yeah. <laughs> <laughs> until end of turn creatures get control gain trample and get plus x plus x where x is the greatest power among creatures i control uh so they're all getting plus 24 24 hang on uh they're getting another two yeah Thank you. So they're getting uh, plus 26, 26. Uh, oh god, I need a calculator. You, you really don't. <laughs> you really don't. I think it's funnier that way. Okay, so I think <laughs> Galta and Mavrin at Kuro. Yeah. And Galta Primal Hunger at Benji. So. You could kill me Hunger. with a citizen token. <laughs> I could, I could, but I think it's fun if you if you die to dinosaurs. Uh, so that's a forty-eight. Wait a minute, no, but this. Galta says... starts. At... Galta and Mavrin start as a twelve, twelve, right? Right, uh, but it's gonna be a twenty-four because of 
No, it's gonna be 12 plus. Ugh, God. It's 12 be plus 24. And then. A 36. Uh, 76, uh, 76, 36, because of, uh, the so Dominus. Yes, wonderful. 76, 36 <laughs> is going at, uh, Kuro. Yeah, I yeah, I deserve this it. Will, this will also be a 76, 36, and it will go at, uh, Benji. And, and there will also be tokens that will be made, but I don't think it matters. I, no. No, but you know, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you got it. <laughs> Woo! Right, that was. I can't what believe What a roller that's, coaster. That's the biggest Galta and Mavern has ever gotten, is a 76. That's incredible. And all it took was the combined powers of Ixalan <laughs> working the game. I know solidarity is what it took. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was excellent. All right. Yeah, that was awesome. Okay, well, thank you very much, my guest, for uh, for for uh, uh, shooting it back with me. Uh, so let's just do a really big go around the circle again. We'll start with Dana. Just uh, who you are in the magic community, where people can find you, um, and if you have any appearances at any conventions or anything coming up soon, or if you have any projects that you're finishing up soon that you would like chat to be aware of so that we can be on the lookout for it, please do tell us now. Well, I'm Dana Fisher. You can find me pretty much everywhere at Dana Fisher MTG. Uh, Twitch is at Fisher Magic, um, and I'm active on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, a little bit on YouTube, but mainly Twitter and Instagram, and Twitch. And um, I'm gonna be at DreamHack Dallas at the beginning of June, and I'm going to be at Magic on Amsterdam at the end of June, um, and. I'm excited that uh, in just about a week, I'm gonna be able to start competing in the Ver Venus and Mer Mercury League, or the VML, which oh. is an arena league for uh, marginalized genders, which I'm super stoked about. Awesome. All right, well, I'll, I'll see you at both of those events. I'll see you at both Amsterdam and uh, Dallas. Awesome. Max, so. Cool, we'll have to get a game in, and um, congrats on the, or you know, good luck at the, the VML. Thank you. Uh, all right, over to Benji. Well, hello. I'm still Benji the Brewer. You can still find me on Twitch and Twitter and TikTok at Benji the Brewer. You can also find me in Moxfield at Benji underscore the underscore Brewer, um, where you can find all the decks that I play on stream. You can also see all the decks that I brew on stream because I do an EDH brewing stream called Brewing with Benji uh, every Wednesday and Sunday. Uh, check out my Twitter and Twitch for updates on those. And uh, this Sunday from 10 a.m. to midnight, catch me playing with a lot of amazing uh, people in the Magic community. Uh, Filthy MDG Casuals, Beth, the Queen of Cardboard, Amara, Goddess of Blunder, uh, Quinn, uh, Empress Quinn, just to name a few people, are going to be playing. Uh, Cop Cop in chat, hi, nice. will be there. Uh, so it's going to be a ton of fun. Make sure to check it out if you have some time. Uh, but that's me. Thanks for having me. Absolutely, Benji. Thank you very much for, for coming through. And I am sorry that I missed the sign up for it. Um, it was, I, I just I just missed it. That's No, it's fine. It's totally cool. <laughs> But definitely, like, happy future birthday, and I will try to tune in, all right? Thank you. Awesome. All right, and then over to Tori. Hey, I'm Tori. You can find me all over the internet as that nerd Tori on all of the socials. Uh, I primarily do tabletop role-playing game, TTRPG streams and such. Uh, I have some of those coming up that I can't announce yet because they haven't officially been announced, but keep an eye on my socials uh, to see when I'm on uh, tabletop streams. Uh, and then eventually I will get back to streaming on my actual Twitch channel. I do variety gaming of all sorts and uh, sometimes crafting. Uh, and let's see what else. If you're in the Massachusetts, New England area, I'll be at the Watch City Steampunk Festival in a couple of weeks doing my live Foley sound effects with the Post Meridian radio players uh, in our Alice in Wonderland uh, performance. So that'll be cool, too. <laughs> That's so cool. I... I, I, I... One of the, I mean, the reason I ask, like, you know, for, you know, just things about people's lives and everything is just so we can share that we're all magic players, but we all have different backgrounds, but also similar backgrounds and just different ways that we're entering the game and what we get out of it. But it's, it's 
which is all magic to bring us together. So thank you very much for sharing. Uh, I mean, Foley, our, this is freaking awesome. Uh, Benji, you're always constantly making things and you're, you're, the brews are sweet. And uh, I mean, Dana just slays all the time. So just, just, keep, <laughs> yeah. on, just keep on slaying. I'm gonna real, be real honest. I don't have much else besides school and magic. But that's still enough for me. Plenty. That's that's more than more, than, especially with what you do in magic. That is more than enough. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, but honestly, thank each and every one of you. I I hope to get some more games in the future. I'll definitely reach out uh, for for more games uh, for May and June. June's obviously packed, back to back with uh, with uh, uh, shows. But hopefully. Yeah, and I'm traveling in between them. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'll just uh, we'll just get a game in at one of the events. <laughs> Dana, we'll, yeah. we'll do that. Yeah. Um, but yes, everyone else, thank you so much for uh, for hanging out today, and I will I'll I'll, I'll see you later. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Bye.